This was supposed to be a 15 minute fireworks show condensed into 30 seconds of, of sadness. Can you imagine like being a little kid and being so excited to see the fireworks and then yes. it just looks like the entire city is under attack? Happy 4th of July, America and Americans and YouTubers alike. Welcome to the 4th of July spectacular. Such a spectacular. We've got things made in America. By Americans, for Americans, for anyone really. And the diverse spirit that binds us all together. Where else would you have a black and ease guy and a gay Jew from New Jersey together? And what's more American than a fireworks show? This is from a fireworks display from San Diego, 4th of July, 2012. What a huge fireball that is. That was supposed to be spread out over like a half an hour. Somebody definitely got minutes. fired. And then you can kind of hear We Will Rock You start to come in at the end. It's already failed and then to add insult to injury. No, no, <laughs> go home. No it's fireworks. <laughs> this next video, Alex and Ernest insisted that we watch it all the way through for our first time. I've been waiting for this moment for months and it's finally here. I'm finally going to get a heritage unit on camera. Yeah! Oh yeah, listen to that bell. I'm listening. Oh my god! The voice you're hearing is Steve Tirico. He is a self-described foamer, the locomotive enthusiast, and they are so rapidly enthusiastic that they are liable to foam at the mouth. He is celebrating American history. The only way he knows how, like an American, to just scream at something. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah! Oh! So now it's my turn to share something that I feel is a key part of the American experience, and that is competitive eating. We're gonna watch Molly Schuyler take down a 72 ounce steak at Sailor's Restaurant in Portland, Oregon, just this year. I like the way she's attacking it. It's like a wild animal. I don't know why I thought she'd use a fork and knife. Molly Schuyler is a great American because she ate this thing in three minutes. Three minutes. She broke a world record on this, and the first record was by a huge dude who did it in six minutes and 48 seconds, and she crushed that. Where is it going? This is like a magic trick. It really is. That's the American dream, guys. The thing that ties all of these videos together is that they speak to the thing that is essentially American. It's individualism, and you know who speaks to that more than Anyone else in this show? I do not. Double rainbow guy. I've actually never seen this video. I've saved it until this moment. Whoa, that's a full rainbow all the way. Whoa, oh my God, oh my God. Are you feeling it? I honestly feel a deep sadness that I'm not this happy when I see a rainbow. Oh my God, it's full on. So this is in the middle of Yosemite. He has a farm, he moved there in the late 80s. So you can kind of see why this is a 40 million view video. Everybody wants to have the same experience that he was having. <laughs> Is he crying? Yes, I told you. This I didn't understand crazy. that he's openly weeping at the double rainbow. Yeah, this is this is a religious experience for him. God bless America, guys. What is more American than shooting an arrow into a boulder and then jumping off a cliff? Welcome to Devin Superchamp's world's most insane rope swing ever. Into the air, no chance in the sky. People tried this before Devin came along. Yeah, that's not snow, that's all bones. <laughs> <laughs> that guy looks like you. That's me. There's a lot of American values in this. There's uh, a yeah. live free or die. And the, the die part is accentuated in this one. Alex, what is the most American thing you can think of? Apple pie. Wrong, barbecue pie. Actually, Epic Meal Time is Canadian, but in a way, they're more American than any of us. Doctor's warning, you will die from this pork consumption. Don't you want to bathe in those grease bubbles? Okay, let's get drunk. The only way Epic Meal Time cooks is with large amounts of alcohol and large amounts of meat grease. Sausage, ham, steaks, bacon, bacon and more bacon, then put into a pie. It's like grandma's cooking. If grandma was a psychopath, <laughs> then just grab a bunch of meat. Rest in peace, grandma. This video came out in March 2012, and it has over 4.5 million views. And if you really love Epic Meal Time, they just came out with their first cookbook. It supposedly has over a million calorie recipes all combined together. What's more American than that? USA! USA! What are the most American songs ever? The Star Spangled Banner. Born in the USA. Anything by Bon Jovi. America, song. We Stand as One Prepare by yourself. Dennis Madalone. USA. Flagwater. America, we stand as one. USA. America, we stand as one. Dennis wrote this song in 2002. He also produced it. He performed it. Dennis is so cool. He put his phone number on his website. This isn't a game, okay? We're doing it. It's happening. Hello, Dennis. 
Hey, yeah, this is Dennis. Hi, Dennis. This is Miles calling from YouTube Nation. What what drove you to sort of make this amazing video? Right before 9-11 that summer, I was writing a song about, you know, loved ones that have passed away. And then I kept playing this beat, this tune, and, you know, and, and the song was actually almost like singing to me. I put it on YouTube. It was within 24 hours. It had 50,000 hits, and it went crazy. We want to wish you a very happy 4th of July, and thank you for making such a great video and song. All right, you guys have fun. USA! There you have it. That yeah, was the 4th of July it. spectacular. It was that quite was. spectacular. If that wasn't American enough for you and you still need more, check out the playlist after the show. It's got even more 4th of July goodness there it's for you. fantastic. Who better to play us out than a true American hero? Miley Cyrus! And the Britney song was on And the Britney song was on